South Carolina at Kentucky. Kentucky, a six-point favorite. Of course, latest line over at BetUS. This is uh, this is an interesting spot. Interesting spot. This line was at 11 and a half about three days ago. And now, I mean, we're not even close. We're, we're under a touchdown now. This thing has blown through key numbers. Um, South Carolina, one and eight against the spread their last night against Kentucky. Kentucky prides themselves on beating South Carolina. South Carolina is 0-4 against the spread on their last four road games. Kentucky, 6-1-1 against the spread in their last eight games. All of that hinges on Will Levis. Is Will Levis going to actually play in this game? Uh, Matt over at KSR at Kentucky Sports Radio just revealed on Wednesday night that, hey, looks like Will Levis is a game-time decision. Not sure exactly what's going on. Doesn't have to do with the finger that was uh, that was hurt last week against Ole Miss. Uh, this is a, you know, game time decision. We'll see. I'm interested in this big time because I think Spencer Rattler could go in there and have a little bit of success. You look at what Kentucky does, uh, and and they can't run the football. I don't trust whoever the backup is. If you can't throw the football. This is a team that's number 120 in PPA per rush. And that Even after Chris Rodriguez came back last week, I thought maybe he'd be able to help things because he gets a, you know yards after contact. That offensive line still cannot block for him. Like It's it's rough. The offensive line is number 107 in offensive line yards. They're number 118 in stuff rate allowed. Uh, and it's not that South Carolina is great at that. Like Don't get me wrong. But, man... Um, the Kentucky defense, number 14 in PPA per pass. But they're number 97 in explosive passing rate allowed. And South Carolina's number four. I think South Carolina can find some ways to score the ball. I, I'm going to trust South Carolina to cover the six here because I think this could be a field goal game. I think it could be really, really tight. I didn't pull it up on the uh, on the screen, did I? Unbelievable. So here's what I was talking about. Uh PPA per pass on offense for Kentucky. Well, if you don't have Will Levis, I don't know how reliable that number is. My number on this already was Kentucky by a point. Not even a point. So, I mean, it was a really tight line anyway. Um, and when you look at the advantage here, the passing explosiveness for South Carolina. Number four versus number 97. That's something to pay attention to. Just saying. Uh, I think South Carolina can find ways to, to score here. Uh, they're pretty good running the ball. Number six in PPA per rush over the last four weeks. Uh, Kentucky, you know, not great. Uh, not Especially not great with rushing explosiveness. I mean, Ole Miss took advantage of that. Um, I like South Carolina here. I like South Carolina. I think that they'll be able to uh, stay in this ball game. I like them plus the six. I like them plus the 11 and a half. Uh, but, yeah, it's dropped a lot. We lost a lot of value. That's okay. Still going to ride with South Carolina here. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.